and many more gallantry awards including Shaurya Chakras have also been announced for military personnel. Those details will be coming up in just a short while from now. Now on the occasion of the 74th Republic Day, the government has also announced recipients of the prestigious Padma Awards. The Padma Shri, the Padma Bhushan, the Padma Vibhushan, which are given to civilians, the highest awards in the country. The President has approved the conferment of 106 Padma Awards, including many people's Padmas. Take a look at the wrap. The Government of India has announced the Padma Awards, one of the highest civilian recognitions in the country. For 2023, the President has approved 106 names. This year, former Samajwadi Party Chief, late Mulayam Singh Yadav, along with former Karnataka Chief Minister S.M. Krishna, were chosen for the second highest civilian award, Padma Vibhushan. Aditya Birla Group Chairman Kumar Mangalam Birla and social worker Sudha Murthy, who is married to Infosys founder Narayan Murthy, are among the nine awardees of Padma Bhushan, the third highest civilian honor. The late Rakesh Radesham Junjunwala, who was popularly called India's Warren Buffett, has been posthumously honored with Padma Shri, India's fourth highest civilian award, along with RRR movies music composer M.M. M. Kiravani and Bollywood actor Raveena Tandon. Instituted in 1954, Padma Awards are announced on the occasion of Republic Day every year. Bureau Report, India Today.